guys, this is Brandy, otherwise known as Mystery Diamonds, and welcome to my channel. If you're new here, hey y'all. If you're returning, I'm so glad y'all came back. Thank you. Okay, that's kind of new. I always say the hey y'all, but wanted to try something a little new. So, what I have is, this was supposed to be a sneak peek for last week. Um, but, you know, with it being right after the holidays and um, all that, or, you know, right around the holiday-ish time, the mail is crazy. The mail is crazy. So, you know, it's going to be a first look. Y'all, I cannot wait to get into this. So let me get out of the box and see what we got. Okay, I'm back. So this is everything that comes with your Diamond Art Club kit. You get your wonderfully nice, soft canvas that is poured glue, by the way. You get your drills. You get a tool kit. Um... Big sticker sheet, little sticker sheet, and your pamphlet. Now, with the little sticker sheet, I'm one of those that, like, you could put this in a logbook. You could stick it on a mirror if you're keeping track. Or uh, maybe you have a wall of finishes. Um, whatever you want to use this sticker for. I personally put it on the end of my box so that I can, you know, when I stack my boxes up, I can see what is what canvas. Um... Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and show you, before I show you anything else, what kit this is. So I have on what's called, what I call my beachy nails. Um, because they're supposed to represent the surf, you know, surf and the sand and the water. So these are my beachy nails because I might have something a little beachy going on here. I have Couple at the Beach Sunset by Leon. Devin nice Devinus. I have I have I'm so sorry if I have butchered that last name. I I do apologize. But this is a square. It is a 65 by 65. So it is a perfect square. Square. <laughs> it has 60 colors. And this entire thing is a sticker sheet. So that means that you can put your start and your end date here. This is the one that I always put in my logbook. Now, with Diamond Art Club, if this number is up underneath the number 150, it's an AB. So we have one, two, three, four, five. So we have five ABs. And then if you want to see if there's any like fairy dust or iridescence or any of that, you look at the bottom of your list to see if you have anything with a letter on it. So I have Z166. Z stands for fairy dust. So I have one fairy dust. So five ABs and one fairy dust. So that's going to be really kind of cool. I can't wait. Like, look at all those colors. Oh my gosh. This one's going to be so pretty. Oh, now also what comes in your kit, you will get a pamphlet and this is a thank you pamphlet. It tells you everything that's included in your um, kit tips and tricks. There is a thank you code here. If you've never diamond painted before and you need, you know, like maybe you're one of those that likes this visual, likes to see a video, this will take you to a video on how to diamond paint. There's also the written step-by-step -step instructions. And once you have purchased from Diamond Art Club, you can join their VIP Facebook. Now, if you're saying to yourself, well, I've never purchased from Diamond Art Club before, so I can't get all those little nifty codes. Well, I do have codes for you that you could use. So if you have never purchased from Diamond Art Club before, you can use one of two of my codes. So I have this first code up here, which is Mysteria10. That will get you $10 off your very first Diamond Art Club purchase. Or you can use the bottom one, which is Mysteria15. That one gets you 15% off of your very first order. So it kind of all depends on which one's going to save you the most amount of money. Go for it. Got you covered there. Okay. Now, other places that you can get discounts once you have purchased from Diamond Art Club. You saw there was a discount code on the pamphlet. Um, there's also a code on your canvas. There's a code on the shipping label that comes in your box. There's a code on your um, box that your kit comes in. And, of course, if you have not downloaded their app, the very first time that you use their app, you will receive, I think it's 20% discount. Not to mention, always pay attention to the sales and stuff that they are doing on their site because, I'm telling you, it gets me in a lot of trouble because I want to buy stuff and I'm like, but it's on sale. All right. So, in your toolkit, everybody pretty much gets the same thing in a toolkit with a few little exceptions, okay? And... So everybody 
gets a pen and a squishy. Yours may be a different color than mine. Everybody gets a flat, thin four and seven placer so that you can multi-place. You get a bag of baggies. You get a tray that comes with a stopper. You know, so you can put that... Well, I have it, I have it in wrong. <laughs> but you can put your stopper in so that it, it can stop drills from just flying out the end there. Um, you do get a thing of heart caddy wax. Now, there are two waxes in here. If you're new to diamond painting and you don't know this, there are plastic pieces on both the front and the back. So you do want to take that off before you stick your pen in there. Otherwise, you're not really going to get any wax. Now, everybody also gets a cover minder and washi tape. But your cover minder may differ from mine. So this time, I have a beautiful pink rose. That's a dark pink rose. I like that. And this one happens to be my washi tape. Oh, now that is pretty. Now, what is not standard, because this is a square... It comes with their branded Stabby McStabberson tweezers. These things are sharp. They will draw blood if you're not careful. So you kind of want to keep the sheath on them when you're not using them. Now, I diamond paint squares with my tweezers. Um, now, if you have a round kit, you will not get the tweezers. You'll get everything else, but you won't get the tweezers. Okay, so let me put up the toolkit and let's look at this canvas. Okay, are we ready to see the canvas? I am too. Because anytime I take them out of my box, like I purposely roll it face down so I don't see the, the canvas. So I have no idea which way is up. Oh my goodness. Okay, and I am going to, because this is a 65 by 65, so it's not super large. So I am going to try to zoom out to see if we can see the whole canvas. So this shows you the whole canvas. Now, what is so special for me about this canvas like I love this look at this beach this couple and sunset now this one holds a lot of meaning for me because um you know I live in Florida I did not always live in Florida I lived in Alabama but my husband lived in Florida um, I have known my husband since I was 13 years old um and we dated and then we separated and when we got back together, uh, he was in Virginia. And so he took me. Now, granted, <laughs> it wasn't during sunset. Um, it was too cold during sunset because he took me in in February. It was really cold. But he took me out to Virginia Beach. Um, we had a special memory where we had spent a lot of time together at Panama City Beach. So he decided to take me out to Virginia Beach. And um, I'm freezing cold. But that is where he proposed to me. And so whenever I see pictures of couples on the beach, you know, it kind of brings back. Granted, granted, he proposed when it was nighttime. But you know what I'm saying? We have a lot of special memories of us being um, as a couple on the beach, standing in the waves, looking at the water, looking at the sunset. And so this one has such deep meaning for me. And y'all, I all know I love colors and this is <gasps> color perfection. Now when we get closer, I'll tell you if it's a lot of confetti or not, because I know I saw a lot of people that were asking about that when they saw this image. Um, all right, so I'm going to turn this over and we're going to take a look at the drills. Okay, so one of the things that I do love that Diamond Art Club does is when they give you their drills, they're always one, packaged beautifully. I can manage to put them back in their package. I don't, I can't necessarily put them as gorgeously as they come, but I try my best. But one thing that they do is they put a sticker on your drills that tells you the name of the kit as well as the number of the kit. So this is helpful because there are some people that to save space, they don't keep their paintings in their boxes. So what they'll do is they separate their canvases. Like they may have a, um, some people have like a drafting table and they'll just lay all of their canvases flat. And they can, you know, they can stack them up. Uh, some people put them under their beds. Some people hang them up in their closets. There's all kinds of things that you can do if you are one that takes the canvases out of the boxes. Now me, I do know they take up a lot more space. But I'm kind of terrified to take them out of the boxes because I know even though they have done this, they've given us this, 
me, I would lose the drills. It, would, it wouldn't just be one set of drills. Like, I'd lose the whole bucket of drills, you know, um, because I, I don't know. I don't know. The, it, it creatively hides from me um, I because I think that I'm putting them in safe places. The only place they're safe, as I've said before, is from myself. Um, but I do like that they do that for people that do separate those. All right. Are you guys ready to go down to Crinkle Town? I'm ready. Let's go to Crinkle Town. Oh my God, these colors. Oh, oh, these colors are breathtaking. Okay, so let me give my little spiel. So when I go through the colors, I do this thing called chipmunk mode. What this means is that I speed up the film and when I do, it makes me sound like a chipmunk, hence chipmunk mode. Um, now, if you are not a fan of chipmunk mode, that is perfectly okay. You can mute the video and just watch the colors go by or you can fast forward and you're going to say well how do I know when to stop if I'm fast forwarding well I've made it easy for you all during the time that I do chipmunk mode I put a little picture up in the corner of a chipmunk and he stays all throughout chipmunk mode and when you no longer see him in the corner you know chipmunk mode is over if you are one that wants to skip it um, but for those that enjoy chipmunk mode chipmunk mode activated Okay, so we're just going to go ahead and look at this one. Like, look at that peach color, 352. That is a gorgeous peach. So we have 3760, 3856. Now, you can't, it kind of looks yellow in the camera, but it's a very light peach. 741, this bright orange, there's two of those. 3823, this is a very light yellow. 743, which is a bright yellow with, with a with an orange hanging out there because it said it was beach and it wanted to be in with the yellows. But we got two of those. So look, seven, see, it was 740. Now it's trying to hide. 740 is right there. Just, it, it just he, He's hiding from his parents in this bag over here. But we have this other bright orange, 740. 3846, this really pretty blue. Up, up, up. Here is our first AB. And look at that big old bug. As I like to say, it's a smack a deck bug. Um, so, AB stands for Aurora Borealis. And what this means is that I'm hoping y'all can look. Shake a shake. Hey, 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 stop showing me your back sides and give me something I can show the camera. There we go. So, as you can see, hopefully, on the ones that are not showing their little rear ends over here, um, there is a iridescent coating that is on the top of this drill. And what that does is it, it shines different colors. So, you can kind of see like a green there, a blue, purple, orange, yellow. And it just makes, oh, makes everything just gorgeous. And we have one large bag of that. And, oh, whoa! 129 is also an AB. And we have two of that. Oh, my God, is that in the sky? Is that in the sky? <gasps> two. Oh, I love, thank you, DAC. I love it when you give us two, two and three and four of the big drill. Ah, okay, sorry. I just, I love it. Like, look at that. Oh, oh wait, you are not an AB. Who told you you could be in there? Who told, I mean, you, you came from somewhere. You're a light peach. You do not belong in there. Well, it, it wanted to be fabulous by extension, I guess. That's okay. That's okay. We'll, we'll forgive you this time, dude. We have two bags of 742. Ooh, we have three AB colors in the big bags. Like, wow, they want this thing to sparkle. I love it. Thank you, thank you. So 119 AB. Look at that purple. Oh, my God. Okay, 3755. There's two of those. 963, which is a pretty pink. 3845. I kind of like that one. That's like an electric blue. All right, let's look at the next train. Um, so we have 3845, another pretty one. That's not the same as the other one, is it? Did I just sit here and think that I have the same color? 30, yes, I do. Look, look, see? Sometimes, oh, look, look, we found another little straggler in there with the, with the blues. I wasn't crazy. So this is your big train of 3845, and then you have a smaller mid-sized train of 3845. So you have a one and a half. You have one and a half bags, essentially. See? Sometimes I think I'm going crazy, but I'm really not. And then we have 3348, so this is our medium train. 921, this brownish color, topish. 402, 402, see, this is my, like, beachy, sandy color. I don't know. That, I know technically most sand is not that color, especially not here. We have white sand. So we have 3782, there's two bags of that, and up. Oh, we have a medium-sized bag of 141. Y'all, this one, this AB is my favorite AB because with it being the white AB, y'all, can y'all see those purples and blues and pinks and just... <gasps> what, are that, what do the kids say? Chef's kiss. My chef's kiss. Um, 3843, 3325, uh, 918, 797. That's a really, really pretty blue there. 3041, that's like a dusty purple. 995, y'all, I've become to where I really like that color, 995. 310, look, that's it. That's it. If you have been living in worlds of 310, then, you know, go grab this canvas, because this is not in a world of 310, y'all. No, no. No, it's in a world of color. World of color. Okay, y'all don't want to hear me sing. Sorry. 919. 993. Ooh, look at that. Heel. 3857. 3854. 893. Ooh, pretty fuchsia. 3607. Okay, what train do we have next? Okay, so we have... Well, no. No, we're not... We're not um, we'll go here. This is a... This is a shorter medium train. See, shorter. We have 3371, which is like a really dark brown with, with a little lavender. I'm telling you, these people, these, they, just, they go visiting. They, these are very social drills. Very social. I'm very proud of y'all for being so social. 211, 
3776. I don't know what number I was trying to say. 796-3726. Now for what I call the baby train. I call it the baby train because this is a train that has the you know, increasingly smaller amount of drills. Not that there are any more. They're still fabulous, but there are just not as many of them. 3853, 951. Oh, there is our fairy dust. Z166. There's this bright green. Now, I don't know if my camera is going to show you. Um, but where it kind of looks like there's glitter, that's actually not glitter. Fairy dust has this thing, this like mica powder in it, which is very fine, fine. It's a lot finer than glitter. And oh, y'all, it just gives it what I call an ethereal look. Love it. Oh, and there is, I think, our last AB, 108, which is an uh, army-ish green. 3746, 333, 161, 301, 336, 3712, 937, 992, 3801. Ooh, that teal. 3812. Oh, I like that. It's so much brighter in person than you can see on the camera. It's like, imagine just boom, right. I love it. 820, 378, 3609. Look at that pink. 935, 632, and 3830. The colors! Okay, so we are out of chipmunk mode now. So I'm going to turn this over and we're going to check and see how much confetti um, versus uh, color blocking. And I'll kind of explain when we're looking at it. Um, so give me just a minute. Okay, as I'm looking at this canvas, there's really, there's not a ton of what we call confetti, which is where you're constantly changing out colors, like where you might only have one or two um, of one color and you have to switch out for others. Um, because, hopefully you can see there, they have what I call, this is like called, what I call color blocking confetti. Because color blocking is where you have a lot of the same symbol in an area. Um, but you do still have to change color. So you see how you're, you're going to get some color blocking going in here. And then you're going to have to change your colors. So most of the canvas is that way. Um, until you get to down here, and even here, you still see that there are nice little, you know, small little sections of that color blocking confetti. So this one is not, this one is would not be what I call true confetti. So if you were looking at this and thinking, well, you know, I'm not a confetti person, that, this is not a confetti canvas. And before we start looking at where all of our AVs are, I want to show you a couple of things um, about the canvas. First, I want to show you, they always come with this scalloped and surged edge here to prevent it from fraying. It is on a sparkle canvas. And like I said, it is poured glue. And the drills on a Diamond Art Club, to me, are clear. Now, yes, that one, like you may you may see like a little bit of, but I, I still can see that one very, very clearly on that green. And of course that is our AB. That's one of our ABs. But the symbols are always clear. And now, now we have, this is a thicker cover sheet. And it is one of the um, perforated cover sheets where, you know, you, you just, you, you tear it and it gives you these little, sections that you can work with so you can just you know you can just tear off the section however big of a section that they have there just tear it off and the rest of it stays with the plastic and you're good to go now you can still y'all you can still use if you use covered paper i use covered paper you can still use that not a problem but i do like that they are giving us this option of um the perforated cover sheet. So I am really happy for that. Okay, so now let's get into where these ABs and fairy dust are. Okay, this is going to be easier for me to just show you in sections because where is there not some form of AB or special? Because you see here's your four, that light color, and you also have your two you also have, uh, right here, you have your one. So those are all ABs. And then there is the, I know I saw the, yep. As we come down, there is your plus. That is your fairy dust. Okay, so basically if you see a one, two, or three, see there's a three right there, or the white dot those are ABs and stuff like, look, there's some more fair, uh, AB, 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 whoops, fairy dust, AB, what are there, number two right there, number three, 
two. Okay, so now this section doesn't seem to have too much. Let's go up to the front. Kind of showing it to you in sections. Okay, so this one you can see the three over there. There's some more three fairy dust. I mean, not fairy dust. Why do I keep calling it fairy dust? A, B. There's some two A, B. There's one. So you can see they've kind of got it going all throughout the sky here. Look, there's some more big sections of that three um, A, B. They seem to like that 3AB. But then I think that's the one that we have two of, if I'm correct. I think that's the one we have two of. And then um, if you can see the white sections right here, those are that white AB. Okay, so we have some more of the three in the sky. So as you can see, going throughout the sky, there's some more of the green AB. There's some more of that three. They want this guy. There's the white. There's some more of the three AB. More of the white. Three. So this guy has a lot of ABs. Now let's look at the bottom. Or I guess we're going to look at the, the middle first. So in this middle section, I don't really see unless, you know, shout it out at me if you see some uh, ABs. Now, I know there's ABs right here. Um, oh, okay. So, in our water, in our water, we're starting to get some more of the blue ABs and that purple AB. Um, we don't have ABs on our silhouettes, which is perfectly fine. Um, going back over here, there's some more of the purple AB, some more of that three AB, some more of our white purple three i'm telling you look at the like just when i say there's not a ton of sections that don't have abs look look how many times you see either a you know a one two three four or a white dot or a cross now there's that fairy dust we don't have as much of it right so that one's not all over the place Mostly, this one is going to have your um, your ABs. There are places, see, there's some more of that one AB. There are places that you're going to see more of some colors than the other, but usually it's in the top part of the sky and the bottom part with the water down here that you're going to see that blue this three color that's the one that we have two bags of so that one is kind of all over this canvas um just all over in just patches everywhere and once we get down here um, there are some areas in the sky that have the white ab but it's mostly in little reflections here in the water where the sun is reflecting on the water and i mean i think that makes this perfect because that's one of the things that I, I do like about this is that, you know, you have, you have this beautiful sky. And if y'all have ever, you know, you've gone out at sunset, right? And the sky, nature is amazing. And it changes and has these multi-hued colors going all throughout it, which I just find gorgeous, right? As the sun is sinking into the horizon. Um, and, you know, I've... One of the things I love about water is being able to watch those reflections um, mirror on the water. And so this one, oh, y'all, this one is absolutely beautiful. And like I said, this has special memories for me. So now this is, this would be us back in our thinner days, thinner, younger days, but I'm going to think of this like me and my husband, although she, she's a lot taller. I, 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 I came about right here to my <laughs> I'm shorter than she is. But you know what? I'll take it. I, I think this piece is breathtaking. Oh, my gosh. So, it's still available last I checked. So, you know, you might want to go hop on there and get it. So, I want to say thank you so much, Diamond Art Club, for sending this to me. Um, I hope that you guys have enjoyed this first look. So, you know, maybe if if you, you saw the picture but you didn't really know until you could see the canvas, um, hopefully this might have uh, encouraged you to go take a closer look because it really is 
fabulous looking. And if you're worried about confetti, there's really not a ton of it. It's color blocking confetti, which is the easiest kind or easier kind of confetti. So, I mean, and then you still have big swatches too that have give you plenty of color blocking opportunities. All right. Well, that's all that I have for you. I really hope that you've enjoyed this. If you have, please give me a thumbs up. It greatly helps the channel. And if you're new here and you haven't subscribed, I would love for you to subscribe. Come join the crazy. That is me. Um, but just make sure that you hit that bell icon for all notifications. That way, you know, anytime that I upload a video or anytime I go live, hope to see you guys there. All right. I'm going to leave you like I always do. Reach for the stars and grab hold, hold on and never let go. Until my next video. Bye, guys.